Hello VC, uh, Olivier back for a new video. I'm just coming back from a business trip uh, in uh, Italy where I spent uh, only two days but uh, one of the evening uh, you know I had some free time an hour or so and uh, you know I checked out on the Google uh, record shops near where I was in Bologna and uh, you know, I had kind of an hour uh, left and I went quickly there, uh, you know, to check uh, in one of the record shop with that shoes out and I will come back to that and let you know why I chose this one. And I went there and I found some great stuff. So, you know, starting with this first record from Goblin and uh, the story around that is that uh, I watched the, the, the I mean, I, I'm, I'm watching all videos from Sublime Media, from Jonas, uh, uh, where, you know, he has a series that he started some time ago about his uh, five stars uh, records, I mean, five stars which he grade on, uh, on Discogs, so, and Goblin was one of them. And to be honest, right, I don't have any knowledge in uh, Italian prog rock so but Jonas was saying that Goblin is a five star so I had this record in mind when I went to the shop and I saw it and I just bought it and look I listened to it I just gave a one spin I mean it's a really great record and so Jonas you're right I agree with you it's a five star record and uh, look uh, it's not an original one so all the records I will show you the Italian uh, prog records are not original ones, but they are really, really good records. So that's the, the Goblin record, it's a gatefold. That's the inside of the record. <clears throat> the back. And we get out you know, <clears throat> the inner. It's a reissue from the last years, but again, really, really a great Italian uh, prog rock band. Uh, yeah, it's uh, the, 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 the original soundtrack from a movie, and I really, really liked it. The next one, I mean, the owner of the record shop I was, was a really, really nice guy. And, uh, you know, I asked him, I said to him, look, I don't have any knowledge in uh, Italian uh, prog rock and uh, I would like to get your advice on, you know, what what I should have uh, and, uh, and uh, you know, great bands, great records. So the next one he came with, he told me, oh, this record is really a great record. So the band is called uh, Il Balletto di Bronzo, or Di Bronze, Di Bronzo. You have it here. And, uh, you know, they did several albums. I checked out on the, <coughs> on the Discord and this uh, album is, uh, is really their masterpiece. So it's a really, really great album. Reissue as well, a really nice reissue with a gatefold and a booklet inside, uh, you know, with the, the, the song page and uh, the lyrics, I guess, from their songs. Uh, it's in Italian, right? It's Italian prog rock, so they sing in Italian. But uh, it's a really, really nice record. And here you have a picture of the band. I mean, it's a reissue on the Polydor label. And, uh, you know, really, really great stuff. I really highly recommend for those who don't know Italian prog rock to check out uh, on the internet. There are many, many good things. And I was really blown out. And this one again, uh, Il Balletto di Bronzo, uh, really, really a great band. <clears throat> Next one is a band which is called The Trip. Uh, it's uh, originally a UK band or band made of uh, British guys who went to Italy in the early 70s or late 60s. Um, and, uh, you know, after their first record they started as well to have some uh, Italian guy playing with them and that's the case on this record which is uh, prog rock as well more heavy prog rock and I think their first record was uh, was more uh, tending towards uh, a kind of blues rock but uh, 
but that's definitely prog rock, heavy prog rock, and it's a really, really good record. It's as well a gatefold, so you have some really nice pictures of the band. And, uh, you know, the, 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 this band, I mean, I, I read that on, on, on internet, I mean, at the early beginning, uh, Blackmore was part of this band. And uh, I'm not sure, it, it's, he's not playing on this record for sure. I don't think as well that he played on the first record. I mean, he played with them before they, they started to record the records. I, I'm not sure, right? I mean, that's definitely something to, to check out. Or if someone knows, I mean, I'm happy to, to read that in the comments, right? And again, it's a really, really uh, good pressing as well. The sound is perfect, a reissue. But uh, again, really great one, The Trip. And the album is Caronte, which is again supposed to be, uh, according to what I read, uh, really the masterpiece of uh, The Trip. Next one, and again, a great record. And again, as I told you, I mean, the, the owner of the shop uh, gave me some advice and he was really really good and he gave me definitely really great advice so that's a, a band called metamorphosis uh, inferno which is the, the title of the record they didn't do a lot of album i think two or three maximum and um, and that's again uh, their masterpiece and it's uh, definitely a great prog rock uh, record uh, it's uh, again you know uh, a record which uh, I would rate uh, a five star as well if I would have and I would definitely rate it on, on this bug and I will put it at five star as well. A really really nice one I was uh, and the quality you know of the, the repress is great the quality of the the, 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 the record and the, the cover is great as well it's thick cardboard uh, really, really good stuff, really good material, and uh, high quality uh, pressing. The last one, uh, it's not an Italian prog rock band, and that's uh, what I would call a jam, and it's a UK uh, prog rock band. And for the story, when I checked out on Google, and I, I put on Google record store near me, and uh, Bologna has a, a lot of uh, record stores, and uh, you know, I checked out on Google, and I was looking at the comments from the people and some pictures and uh, as you know when you go to google i mean the people they take uh, pictures in the record shop and they put them on google and then you know you can go through and in this uh, record shop i saw that they had on the wall uh, several records and really good records and one of them was this aquila uh, record obviously i mean sometimes this picture can be quite old and i was not sure that this shop had his Aquila record still available. Uh, that was one thing. Uh, the second thing is that, uh, you know, um, I, I checked out on, 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 uh, on online as well, and Aquila, uh, again, it's a UK uh, prog rock band. I had this, uh, this album on my want list because I, I have seen a review on, on, on YouTube and uh, on the VC, and uh, the guy who made the review was saying really good stuff about his album. And, uh, when I checked on Discog, I realized as well that, uh, you know, there was a, a reissue done in Italy. So when I saw the picture on Google, I thought, okay, look, it might be not the original. It might be the reissue from Italy, which I would have been fine with. And, uh, you know, maybe this record is not available anymore. But I say, if there is a shop selling, uh, you know, Aquila or having Aquila or had Aquila at one stage, I'm sure that I will find many other things uh, which I will like as well. So when I arrived there, I, I, I immediately checked on the wall and I saw the record, so it was still available. I got closer to the record, I saw the price, which made me believe that it's definitely not uh, a reissue. It's an original one, so I paid quite a bit for it. I mean, the owner was nice at the end, he gave me a price for, for all the records I took. But still, it was, was not a cheap one, but again, I think uh, Aquila is a, uh, is a band uh, from the UK, prog rock, which did only one album. And by the way, that's what we are listening to in the background, right? And, uh, and uh, you know, and the originals are going for a lot of money, and that's an original.
so it's a gatefold as well and it comes on RCA uh, record I don't have the record here because I'm just listening to but really really great stuff so for those who don't know Aquila I've never seen it I highly recommend to check it out uh, online it's a really really great band really great record so yeah that was now a quick video on my uh, just um, on my you know coming back from Italy I wanted to to put that online as quick as possible and uh, I hope guys you enjoyed it uh, I'm uh, really happy to get your your comments if there are some other Italian prog rock bands that you would recommend uh, or maybe even some great UK gro uh, rock, uh, prog rock band like Aquila. Uh, I'm really happy to get your advice, comments, and uh, you know, I will definitely look forward and I hope, uh, you know, to speak to you soon. Have a good day. Bye.